So hello everybody. As you can see we're working on the free motor at the moment. I've set up some lights in my shed for when it's night so I can work when it's a bit dark. And so I've drained all the oil out of this. So let's pull it apart. Today we're going to weld onto the cam so we can get a bit higher lift. So guys, this one, it, this is a cam. This is from my old motor. This is the one we're going to be welding. So we've set it all up. We've got some blue jeans covering the rest of it so we don't get slag anywhere. And then we're going to just weld right on the top the point of the lobe and get that a little bit higher. So this is the old one. And yeah. There you go. So that's my first one. I'm not going too overkill on this. Uh, I'm just using a stick welder. Uh, that still needs to be cleaned up and smoothed off a bit. Uh, but on to the next one. Now I'm just going to clean it up on a bench grinder. Well I reckon that looks pretty good, but I think I want more lift than that. So I'm going to put put on the welder again, and then take it back to the bench grinder again. So guys, I've done quite a bit more welding, and I've grinded it down and stuff, so it looks a bit better. It still doesn't look very good, but... It's on the inside of the motor, so who cares? Uh, on the intake, which is the close one, I've gained 3 mils of lift. And on the exhaust, the far one, I've gained 2 mils of lift, but as you can see, it's a lot wider, so it has a lot more time that it's open. I was going to do that for the intake, but uh, time-wise, I couldn't be bothered welding some more so I might have to see if three mils is too much I don't want the valves hitting the top of the head but otherwise she should be right to go also uh, I've drilled a hole opposite to the one that's already there because it's I've added mass to this so I have to reduce the mass from somewhere around here uh, so now the primary balances should be a bit more balanced. I put the end of the camshaft into my drill and I can feel the vibrations and I drill that hole bigger and bigger until I can barely feel it. So I've given my motor a little bit of a wash up. It's um, getting a bit dark here but uh, turns out that three millimeters of lift, uh, th three millimeters more of lift is too much so I had to bring it down to two millimeters of lift on each one because three mils it was hitting on the side wall of the motor and so I've brought it down to two mil and it's not hitting anything and it should be all good to go should be running in another video